Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time today. We're going to take a look at a 2024 Grand Design Transcend model number 321 BH, weighs 7,700 pounds. It's got a double bathroom, double bedroom, great living space with the TV across from the couch. This thing's got more features than there are ways to die. I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brendan Hannemeyer, on the camera today. Brendan? What's going on, happy campers, huge campers, and fellow salespeople? Thanks so much for tuning in to the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. We got an awesome like and subscribe button sitting down there. If you don't mind clicking that, we'd really appreciate that. Also, a comment section. Let us know what you think about the new exterior going on with Transcend and also the other little features that they have. We're on Instagram, TikTok, and we're on Facebook. We do shorter videos there, but they're pretty sweet as well. Enjoy this Transcend. Right on, B. We got ourselves a front power jack, 20 power paint tanks, and there's going to be a battery in a box location going in behind there. Wood frame, aluminum skin on these transcends. They incorporate what they call the quad seal, which is basically two layers of PVC foam plus a mylar tape plus silicone on here. So, really, really well sealed uh, unit without putty, so it's not going to ooze out uh, and break down over time. So, that's really fantastic. Pass through storage all the way through to the other side. Right here's your convenience center on your right with your city water connection, fresh water fill, solar disconnect, trailer disconnect, outside receptacle, 40 amp charge controller on these now for 2024 with 165 watt solar panel on the roof. Manual jacks, one on each corner, black water flush kit, main sewer drained right through here. 15 inch tires, six bolt hubs, black rims, but chrome don't get you home. And then we have our secondary sewer drain in through here. Rack and pinion style slide, Brennan. Rack and pinion, baby. That pulls our couch and our dining off the floor. We got windows in that slide. We're gonna pop that thing open here shortly. How we doing, B? Great, thanks for asking. No problem, 50 amp detachable <laughs> style cord, roof ladder. Get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. One piece roof, which is just how I like my grandmother's bathing suits. We're prepped up there for a backup camera. We're gonna put a perfect looking Maroon spare tire cover on there from Lazy Acres. Outside spray port, two burner stove top. <clears throat> Shelf in through here with a receptacle. Two, two cubic foot electric fridge. So it's 7.50 in the morning. Don't get too close there, eh? <laughs> yeah. Can't show off Sam. Uh, can't show off your wife. Can't say her face now on video, <laughs> yeah, right? Exactly. They're gonna find her. Oh shit! <laughs> yeah. Electric awning right here. Going all the way forward, covering our main door. Three step entrance up and in. Lend a hand, grab handle. Gravity feed, fresh water fill, outside speakers, porch light, range hood vent, on demand, Gerard, water heater, furnace vent, outside receptacle, outside TV location if you want to do that. And then for travel access here, it's really, really great, Brendan. Like through the secondary door here, we can get to our main bedroom quite easily. We can also get to our bathroom. And then from the main door, <coughs> race it down there, Brendan. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we can get to our living space, our fridge. We can even get to our bunk room and our secondary bathroom. Let's get this thing opened up. Right on folks, we're inside that 321BH. You've walked in the back door there. A couple big changes here for 2024 is they've eliminated the carpet here on our flush floor slides, which is great. The on-demand water heater, this new LED light track system. It spans the full width of the trailer, which really eliminates shadows. We hate shadows here at Lazy Acres because evil lies in the shadows, right, Brenna? Exactly. Keep going back to the well? Keep going. All right, brother. We got ourselves our theater seats here facing our TV location. You can option in a trifold sofa here, but this is the theater seat. Window, 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 booth dinette with cupboard space underneath that booth. It's really nice that there's no carpet underneath the dinette because that's where a lot of crumbs are gonna fall. We got the reversible seat cushions if you don't love the pattern. I love the pattern, Brennan. I would too, I would keep the pattern. I would keep the pattern. And then I like how they finish off the tops and sides of these booth dinettes now with the uh, Without the fabric, it's just a little more durable finish. Um, and then we have our bathroom in through here. Let's get after the kitchen though. Undermount stainless steel sink. Big cupboard there for garbage can or recycling. A couple drawers here. A couple more drawers down in through here. No oven, so they've replaced that with a big drawer. Glass stove top cover, three burner stove top. Range hood, microwave, convection microwave, and air fryer. Shelf in through there, good spot for a cereal box. Plates and cups. Bowls and cups, 
and then good counter spacing through here with the kitchen window. And then right here is our eight cubic foot 12 volt fridge. Running off our battery, our battery being charged off our solar panel while we're going down the road or while we're, uh, sorry, solar panel while we're dry camping and then being charged off the truck while we're going down the road. Drawer here. Pantertainment. Look at all that space. That's fantastic. Open shelf here. TV, and then as you come in the main door where you started off the video, this is a great spot to kick off your shoes, hang up your coats, your controls, or everything you're here. And look how big and deep that space is in there. And then do we got something here, Brendan? We used to. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that. <clears throat> nice closet there. USB to charge a cell phone while you're just hanging out. Love that. Now, <clears throat> into our secondary bedroom. We're coming right in here. We've got the corner style bunks, which is really a quad bunk idea. Uh, but if you have longer children, you can sleep them here across the back side. That's a full eight feet of length. we got a shelf, shelf, a couple drawers, four of them back in through here. Really nice built-in ladder, a couple more smaller drawers here. And then a great closet there, shelf in through there, a couple windows in through here. That's a great secondary bedroom with a secondary bath. Porcelain toilet, dump truck fits, cupboard space there. Sink, counter space, no medicine cabin, but we do have a light. You have a light in the bathroom, right, Brandon? Oh, yeah. Did you show off around the corner there in that bedroom? I didn't. No. Just watch, but it's TV. <clears throat> just a great, you know, the kids can actually pull their clothes on. There's just a good amount of space in there without doing the second slide, right, Brandon? Exactly. Into the bathroom here, we got ourselves a porcelain toilet. Dump truck fits. Cupboard. Shelf, shelf counter sink medicine cabinet and then up into the shower i'm six feet tall your boy josh fits in through here Not in the door. shelving in through there and then into our bedroom which you already kind of got a sneak peek of in the travel access part but that's a full 60 by 80 inch queen drawer on either side hanging on either side open shelf the good looking uh headboard there and then we do have a secondary door we talked about show us the storage where under the bed Oh, jeez, <laughs> pretty freaking man. <laughs> Still early in the morning. Um, there's your storage underneath the bed, Brendan. How do you feel about it? I feel uh, like we've seen it all now. <laughs> on a scale of one to Josh, how much do you like that storage? Josh. All right. <laughs> hit the like button, the subscribe button. Hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.